Hello, everyone. Excellencies, my dear industry people, and my dear friends. It's my honor and privilege to speak here at the second European Union Ukrainian Defense Industry Forum, DFNC2. First of all, I would like to thank all of your countries, governments, industries, and people. Without your support, we would never withstand in this war. Thank you. This war has started as the Second World War plus drones, but it will finish as the first world drone war. By now, we achieved substantial success in manufacturing of all types of unmanned systems, aerial, ground, and naval drones. And I know that some of those people in the room have witnessed our capabilities during factory visits in Ukraine. We push our industry to use AI in all types of unmanned systems. We already have a solution of AI-driven auto-targeting for aerial strike drones. Next big thing is the swarm of the drones, coordinated attack capability. But our defense industry is not only about unmanned systems. Now we are capable to produce pretty much a full range of weapon and ammunition, from 155 caliber artillery systems to ammunition, from armored vehicles to missiles, and much more. Even more, we actually reinvent conventional warfare, where we had mortar mines, we have now mortar drones or FPV drones. Where we have artillery systems, we've got artillery drones. With missiles, we also got rocket drones. And even in air defense, we are reinventing the conventional approach and having air defense drones now. All of that we call Zbroye. That's the name for Ukrainian defense industry. And we are ready to share what our industry learned in this war with you, our strategic partners. As of now, we already have a few dozens of successful joint ventures between Ukrainian and EU companies. I was always promoting building up capabilities between European and Euro Ukrainian industries. So today we are here again to represent Ukraine and its defense industry capabilities at the highest level. The delegation is led by the Minister of Strategic Industries, German Smetanin. We got Ministry of Defense led by the Deputy Minister Churkin. Also, we got state-owned companies led by the Chairman and the Supervisory Board as well. Private companies represented by the National Defense Industry Council, Association of Associations of Private Defense Industry Producers. We have 47 companies here in the room. Ukrainians are open, creative, hardworking, and willing to collaborate. We are here to build the arsenal of the free world together. Thank you. Thank you very much to Mr. Commission for these very inspiring words as well. And, uh, and uh, indeed, uh, of course, Ukrainians are very hardworking and innovative. And I think we have all admired you, uh, uh, how much you have really managed to, uh, you know, uh, uh, um, to do and, and how, uh, how strongly you have managed to, to resist the, uh, the Russian, Russian uh, aggression. Uh, we would now like uh, to uh, make a very quick uh, um, photo of the four keynote speakers, if that would be possible, if you would be please uh, uh, willing to come uh, on stage and the audience please bear with us for a second. Thank you very much. And uh, this will conclude the opening remarks.